Hello everybody, this is Dr. Ben Lim and in the series I am talking about the seven different names of God. God has many names. However, there are seven attributes that are predominantly attached to the name Jehovah. And Jehovah means the Lord, God himself. And today I want to talk to you about Jehovah Shalom. I believe in 2021 to and beyond where there's so many pandemics and alleged new variants and fake news and fear-mongering news going forth. We need peace. The world needs peace. And Jesus, Yeshua, when he came to Jerusalem, to Israel, that was a time where Israel was in darkness. They were in chaos. They were looking for a savior, a Mashiach. And it was the perfect storm for Jesus to come and release peace. The Bible says in the book of Isaiah chapter 9, which is a very famous Christmas verse passage. If for to us a child is born, a son is given, and the government will be on his shoulder, he will be called Wonderful Counselor, Mighty God, Everlasting Father, Prince of Peace. The increase of his peace and kingdom knows no end. Whenever Jesus is in the room, there's peace. But I love this word, peace, in Hebrew because it's holistic. It is entire. In its entirety, peace, shalom, means healing, peace, joy, prosperity, blessing, wholeness. It's not just a peace that you feel, but shalom is a wholeness is a prosperity, is a blessing, it is a joy, it is a oneness in every part of your being. Now, who needs that in their lives? You may be prosperous in one area of your life, but in your mind, you are tormented. You might be happy in your heart, emotionally, but financially, you are depraved. God wants to bring shalom, wholeness in every area of your life. That's the power of shalom. Out of darkness and chaos, God spoke. The waters and the storms receded and were calm as Jesus stood up to the winds and to the waves. Peace be with you. My shalom, my peace I give you, says the Lord. Isn't this incredible? We need peace, we need shalom, and not this peace sign like the hippies or like universalists or like the one world order, no. We need real shalom, which only comes by being in the Holy Spirit. Jehovah Shalom is his name. Say it with me, Jehovah Shalom. Shalom, this word or this name of God is found in Judges chapter six, verse 24. Gideon, who was a scared little man. The, this story starts off with Gideon hiding from his enemies. Have you ever felt bullied and the bullies were chasing you and you had to run around the field and hide under the bleachers? This is the story of Gideon. Gideon is hiding for his dear life because the Midianites, this big, bad, bully football team, was coming against Gideon. And the Gideonites were stealing the wheat and the barley and the food. So Gideon was harvesting in secret in the home, in his house. All of a sudden, he had an encounter with God. And Gideon said, if this is you, if I have found favor in your sight, give me a sign. And God confirms the sign. As God confirms the sign, Gideon responds and builds an altar and said, God is our peace. Come on, somebody. God is my peace. The Lord has met me with shalom. And even in midst of chaos, calamity, and destruction, and famine, I feel the peace of God. Because that is his favor. Many times we will say, if God's in it, his peace will be there. How do you know if a word is from the Lord? How do you know if God is speaking to you 
to go left or to go right. His peace will be with you and guide you, even in the most fearful of times. If God's in it, His shalom will be with you. My peace, I leave you, says the Lord. Do you need to find peace in your life, in your heart? He is with you, friends. Jehovah Shalom. Even as Gideon was afraid, hiding for his dear life, God encountered him and showed him his favor. And Gideon felt the Shalom of God. Shalom is powerful. Peace is more powerful than confusion and calamity. His peace is more powerful than destruction. His peace is greater than the storm. Say it with me, Jehovah Shalom. May Jehovah Shalom rest in your home and be around you today, wherever you're watching from, in Jesus' name. Comment below if you enjoyed this video. Give us a like, a heart, a follow, subscribe, and may the Lord Shalom, Jehovah Shalom be with you.